Yes, my people, we're back again with another video. We've got a social mode artillery version this time. Uh, let's have a look at this. Oh. So, here's we go. Here's the Talaria version of the social motor. Got the social logo here. These phase wires look a bit thicker. No. The casing on it is a bit thicker. Still six gauge. Uh, yeah, quite smooth. They also come with... Let's have a look at this. It's a nice motor. Very nice motor. So yeah, they also come with gearbox bracket available in different colors. Uh, hardware. They've got the screws for the gearbox bracket. So gearbox bracket goes on there, support the gearbox. So yeah, what we're gonna do today, we're going to install this into the Talaria obviously and we're going to tune it up to make it work with the BAC 8000 but on first looks it's a pretty motor very pretty motor so yeah let's go let's go let's loosen up the bolts to loosen off the chain get the chain done so we've got room to play with 17 mil we're just gonna loosen it Should be enough. Yes. Get this chain off. Alright, so that's the chain off. Now we're gonna take the bash guard off. One. I'm gonna undo the BAC kit so we can get to the phase wires as it's already connected. So we need to cut these, um, we need to cut the heat shrink off so we can get this motor out. First we need to remove this BAC kit.
Hawks phase while. Fins wire, remove the encoder plug. Remove the tilt sensor. Tilt sensors don't get used because we're using a BAC kit. Remove the 12 volt inverter. Move the gearbox cover. So as you can see, we've got we've got the gearbox bolt that mounts to the um, bike here. What we're gonna do with this, we have to remove this one first. It's uh, number 15, we put that on. Now it's time to remove this moto. Okay, start with these bolts. Let's get the right size first. Take out the bolt, take out the spacer, Now this motor should be ready to come out. It would help if undone the chain. Let's see. So now we get this chain off, ready to take out. Take this chain off. Okay. A little wiggle. Okay. Now we can unclip a hose. Unclipped. One Tellaria motor removed with gearbox. Now, we need to switch over, switch over this gearbox, everything on here, 
to this motor. We need to remove these bolts, take off these auxiliaries, this bracket, the um, inverter, remove the gearbox, then we're gonna place the gearbox onto here. Another thing, with these bolts, I find that they're really hard to take off because they've got Loctite from the factory. Um, people try to remove these and end up um, breaking the bolts. So I'll say, best thing, heat, yep, is your best friend. So we're gonna heat these up and melt the Loctite. just got to chip them Let's refill up the torch can see they're very tight if you don't use heat on this most of the time you'll end up snapping the bolts take your time on it Just be careful when you do these bolts because, yeah, they are prone to snap. Undo the gearbox mount. Remember the new Tolar the new Tolaria social motor comes with a upgraded bracket. There you go. So let's get this motor off. So yep, one Tolaria gearbox removed. Put that to one side. Okay, now these circlips, we need to remove these clips. Circlip removed. Now we could take the sprocket off and now we can remove this. Okay. Let's clean up this, put some more grease on it. Grease up the spindle. Now what we have, we have the social motor here now. We're going to place this onto the motor. There you go. Now we're ready to start putting everything back on it. Got the 
like it lined up. Screws that come with the social mover. Bracket are sitting there quite tightly. ready to install this back into the bike Sprocket. Then we're going to put the sprocket onto the spindle. Now we put the circlip, circlip, we put the circlip on now. So that's on. We're going to put the gearbox in. Give it a little tap. So that's in. Gearbox bolt. Just going to Put that here for now. We're going to remove the sensor. Okay. Let's see how this fits up now. This looks like a perfect fit. Looks like a perfect fit. Wow. Looks like a perfect fit here, eh, boys. Got this spacer here. So we're back again battery died on the gopro so yeah social motor is installed put the bash guard on and tune it up to the bac controller this is a perfect fit couldn't ask for anything any better and the bash guard fits on there perfectly so i'm going to put this bash card on now and tune it up then i'll show you a video of it running so there you have it social motor in a Telaria running on the BAC kit was hassle to tune up but we got there in the end